Hey everybody, how are you? It's Ginger again. Um, I owe my makeup tonight. Uh, I know it's a little bit out of control. I was playing in some of the makeup that I have in my kit and um, I elaborated a little bit on a Halloween look that I was doing. Um, so never mind me. I'm just playing around here with this makeup. But um, I wanted to show you guys some of the stuff that I have in my kit that is not Ginger Cosmetics. Um, I, you know, I have my own line of makeup. I do have, you know, a lot of stuff in my kit that is from my own line. But I also have quite a bit of stuff in my kit that is not from my own line. Um, some of the stuff that I have is like just regular drugstore brand makeup. Um, really good stuff, really nice colors. Um, and I took a little bit of it out of the kit because I want to show it to you. So, um, here we go. This isn't everything I have, but it's quite a bit of what I have. Um, over here you would see I have some lashes. These lashes are just regular drugstore, um, actually they're, they're beauty supply store uh, lashes. Uh, I paid like maybe $1.99 for them. Just, you know, regular stuff. I, um, I like having stuff like this in my kit, even though a lot of it is, um, you know, kind of sort of like fantasy fantasy lashes or whatever I still like having stuff like this because you never know when you are going to run into that situation where you need something that's a little bit out of the ordinary um, so these are just regular beauty supply store lashes that I bought and if you hear some noise in the background that's my son playing in his little play yard in the living room so um, anyway this stuff is from clean colors um, these two were like really inexpensive they were like I want to say I paid like $3.99 and $2.99 for some of this stuff um, for each palette, but I really, really like them. And the reason I like them is the colors are really pretty and really very vivid. Um, I don't know if you can see that, but the colors are really very vivid. You can see them really, really well. Um, and they go on looking just great. They're highly pigmented. Um, colors. These are um, uh, metallics and you know a lot of times that's just what the doctor ordered depending on what you're looking for, what you're trying to create. Um, so here we go. Um, some regular, regular little eyeshadow um, palettes. I like, um, one of the things that I like about this is it came with a little tiny mirror attached to the side of it um, as well as a sponge applicator. I like that. I think that's really kind of cool. If you're on the go and on the run and you need to, to, to show off some, some stuff, you you know, show off your eyeshadow and stuff, you can um, refresh it anytime you need to. So there you go. This is just all of my regular drugstores. Um, I keep saying drugstore. I mean um, beauty supply store stuff really inexpensive, gets the job done, pretty colors, pretty colors. Um, there you go. And this right here um, was really inexpensive. This stuff um, is my NYX colors. We all know NYX. They're beautiful. They're fabulous. Highly pigmented. Um, you can do so much with this stuff. Um, the single the single shadow pots are great um, and a little goes a long way um, and of course with NYX and everybody knows this that that's familiar with NYX um, uh, you know less is less and more is more for real with this because of how highly pigmented they are and they're very inexpensive um, I have some um, triple shadow palettes here uh, I really liked these when I saw them um, and they've kind of inspired me to do um, three different looks with these three different palettes so you'll be seeing that really soon. Here's some eyeshadows, um, not eyeshadows, eyelashes, I'm sorry, from um, NYX. Um, these are cream shadows that I, again I bought at the beauty supply store um, in my neighborhood. Um, and all of this stuff is, uh, these cream shadows are from Clean Colors. I just wanted to show you how this goes on. 
I love this stuff. I love it. I love it. It's just soft and pretty. And it looks good and it feels great when you put it on. And it lasts really long. And also, um, I tend to use cream eyeshadows um, quite a bit and I'll go over them with glitter or frost just to give it that three dimensional pop and it's awesome. Um, again, NYX glitter liners. I hope you guys can see this stuff. I'm just trying to swatch a little bit of it so that you can see. I just think this stuff is so much fun. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then um, this stuff right here, um, LA Colors, believe it or not. This stuff has been around forever, by the way, because I remember um, playing with the LA Colors years and years and years ago when I first got into makeup and I just thought it was just awesome because even back then they had really great colors. Um, well, I recently found this stuff and I just had to get it. Um, and again, these were really inexpensive um, in my local beauty supply store. They were like $1.99 a palette and you get five colors. And you can see how they swatch. I hope you can see them. I think it's just awesome. So again, with the great um, pigments. And as long as you use a really good primer, um, <clears throat> eyeshadow primer, this stuff stays true to color on the, you know, on application. It's, it's just, it's just great. Um, I also found this um, palette, which um, wasn't very. Uh, it was like it was two ninety nine for this one. Um, all of these, these four right here, were all two ninety nine. Um, let me find one that's already open. This one right here has glitter in it, little silver speckles. Also quite cool. Um, Really great um, on if you, you probably can't see this so good, but really great on if you, um, again, use a primer and you want to pat it on with your brush. Whatever brush it is you decide to use. Um, I say a Teclon brush because those are, are just really fabulous when it comes down to um, glitter and pigments mixed into one another. So. Hopefully you can see that. I don't know if you can tell, but it's pretty sparkly. Um, LA Colors, uh, $2.99 at my beauty supply store. So anyway, this was um, just some of the stuff that I have in my kit that's not Ginger Cosmetics, and I love all of it. Um, they give, you know, just great pigments, um, not a lot of money, you know. Um, true color uh, and it's great when you're first starting out because um, you know a lot of people don't have a lot of money to invest in getting a really huge kit and this is a great way to start off and have a lot of great colors that you can be really creative with and not break the bank so um, that's all for right now I hope you guys liked all the stuff that I showed you I have so much more stuff but I really don't have the time to to show you everything in one shot so I'll do another video showing you um, some of the other stuff that I have and hopefully you'll like it um, and I'll talk to you later bye